Spider-Man Remastered is finally out on PC. This must be one of my favorite titles from the last generation and now it is on PC. Nice. The game plays awesome and I have been absolutely loving the experience. But things are not looking that smooth for all gamers. Some players have reported stuttering, crashing and startup issues. If you are one of them, this video is for you. Now every PC port has a few issues upon launch. It has become a trend now. The same is case with Spider-Man. So the first thing you can try in case the game is lagging and stuttering is updating your graphics cards to the latest game ready drivers. So if you have an Nvidia graphics card, you can go and search for GeForce Experience. You can also download the software, links will be in the description if you do not have it. So you can head over to this driver section and you can search for check for updates. Now as you can see I am in the latest Nvidia Studio driver. But you should be using the game ready driver version if you do not have it. So you can hit the download button and that will start the download for this driver. Once it is complete downloading, you should go for custom installation instead of express installation. Custom installation will do a complete reinstall of the driver and the experience will be the best after it. Nvidia has even launched a game ready driver specially for Spider-Man PC. Therefore, updating to that driver will solve a lot of issues for a lot of gamers. Now next you can turn on hardware accelerated GPU scheduling. To do this open up settings, now go to display, then to graphics, then change default settings. Now turn the setting on. Finally, finally you will have to restart the PC to finish setting up. Now the next thing you can try is downloading and installing the latest Microsoft Visual C++ redistributable files. Now missing Visual C++ files can cause the game to not launch at all. So if your game is launching, then move on to the next fix. This one will not help you. But in case your game is not launching at all, follow the link in the description. Download and install both the x86 and x84 packages and install them. Now the next thing you can try is turning off vsync in the game. vsync is known to cause several stuttering issues. To be fair, it is a flaw technology. So turn it off for good. And the last thing you can try is to disable your overclocking settings. I hate to break it but overclocking hardware causes potential performance issues in video games. So playing the game at your hardware's stock settings is worth a shot. Also, you can close any RGB software. They are known to be real notorious. Okay, so that's it. Although the tricks we stated can help, the actual permanent fix will come from Nexus software. The game is facing some issues on several systems. So the developers will release a patch to fix them all. Anyways, that was for it. Like and subscribe.